I'm gonna put it in the basket. <laughs> What's up you guys and welcome back to my channel. For those that are new here, hi, my name is Rochelle and I like to make thrifting and fashion videos along with a little bit of beauty and just sharing my life with you guys over here on my little corner of the internet. Number one, I'm using a new tripod and I'm feeling like I'm regretting it. I might go back to my old tripod, but bear with me today because I'm trying something new. I am over at Goodwill in Auburn, California. I'm going to go thrifting. I am in town going grocery shopping. So you guys know whenever I'm close to a thrift store, I always drop in. <laughs> I'm mainly looking for like jackets. I really want to find a brown blazer that's hopefully like plaid. That's really what I'm hoping for or like a really awesome jacket. That's what I'm in the in the looks for that's my like main focus but i'm also really open to like dresses and skirts i've been feeling really girly lately too um yeah so let's go ahead and get right on into it all right guys here we are i'm excited let's find some good stuff and also i film a few weeks in advance like two weeks in advance so halloween stuff is still out but by the time you guys see this video halloween is probably over i must start in blazers just because they're close and I am hoping to find a good one. I love the plaid of this one, but I wish it was in brown instead of gray. I already have multiple gray blazers. So I feel bad getting another gray blazer because it's like the only color of blazer I do have other than black. All right, no blazers, but I did find two other little long sleeves as well. This Any one's available kind of like... manager to display for customer service, please. Any available manager to display customer service. This one's kind of like almost like a shiny silk material. It looks like it has kind of a vintage tag. And then this one, I'm not really sure about the style, but I figured I'd try it on. It has kind of like puffy sleeves and like that's rouging at the bottom. I don't know. I'll try it. I absolutely love the print of this and also it looks like it has a really promising like cut. I'm excited about this one. I don't normally like red, but I feel like this is really pretty. I like the buttons, how it like goes all the way down with the little pleating. I think I might try this on even though it's not normally my style. I didn't really see anything else in dresses, so now I'm gonna go over to purses just because I've been really getting into purses and accessories, so I'm gonna go check it out. I like the top of these, and I know that's a really good brand, but I don't really like the flowers on the side. These are cute, but I have ones that are really similar. These are kind of cute. All right, I also found these. They're kind of like a beigey, blocky boot. They look too big for me, but I'm gonna try them on just because I kind of like the style. They're fun and funky. And then I found another pair of black little strappy sandals with a heel. And then these little like Chelsea type boots. Cute. Let's look at the purses. I just found this little cute little black furry jacket in the children's section. It's only like six bucks, so I'll try that on. I'm finding a lot of stuff, you guys. It's kind of a fun little patchwork style. I like that. This one's cute too, it's Liz Claiborne. It has like a little snake print. I just got some boots that would like match this perfectly, so I'm gonna put it in the basket. <laughs> Cute. It's a London fog. Seems in really nice condition. Is this really considered a purse? I really want to remember to go look at the jewelry before I leave because I have found some really great jewelry lately. So before I leave in the front, I have to remember to look at the jewelry and watches. Hopefully I don't forget. I see something. It's cute. like a 
fuzzy nightgown blanket from Victoria's Secrets. <laughs> I also found this really pretty slip looking dress. It's inside out right now, but it has like a pretty sheer crisscross at the top and it's really long. So we'll see if it's pretty. Whoa, check out the pearls on that guy. <laughs> Something about it I actually kind of like. It's kind of fun. Should I try it on just for fun? <laughs> I'm going to. This tripod is not the business, you guys. All right, so in the long sleeves, I found this really, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I found this really nice kind of like light green pistachio top with really fun bell sleeves. This little olive green top with cute little buttons down the front there kind of has like a little floral pattern. And then this is way out of my comfort zone, but sometimes I just like to try stuff on even if it's not my normal style just to see if I might be able to, if I might like it. So this is just like a little yellow, kind of almost houndstooth looking print. Kind of cinches in for a peplin, peplin, pep, peplon bottom <laughs> and then i think now i'm going to go over to the halloween stuff to see if there's anything really cool and different in the halloween because there usually is there's a worker here she's right there she is a... thank you she's in a really bad mood and she just keeps having to put clothes away right where i'm shopping and she is not the nicest look at this gorgeous little beaded bag but what do you put in there? It's so pretty though. I love it. I just don't know when I'd ever use it or what for. So I'm gonna put it away, but I love it. Here we go. Everyone's in a bad mood today, except for me. This is kind of a pretty like holiday sweater it's like all beaded i don't know it's funky but i like it like look at the beading i kind of like the like cut of this shirt but i don't know if i love the print or not see through it so this one's a no that's a cute little style I feel like a pilgrim <laughs> no. the little kid jacket is too tight it's just I can't would have been cute if it wasn't too small. Children's. I hate taking my pants off. I'm lazy. I have to do it. I know so many of you guys give me such a hard time for using plastic bags and honestly I forget all the time my reusable bag but just to let any of you guys know always when I get those bags from Goodwill I reuse them over and over and over again at the grocery store I never throw them in the trash so any of you guys 
that would like to lecture me on reusing things, trust me, I'm a big advocate for reduce, reuse, recycle. I only spent $27, but 10 of that was for something for a friend that she's gonna pay me back. And so I really only spent $17, which is exciting, but I did get a few cute little things. So I will just show you guys a haul of everything I got when I get home or maybe even tomorrow, cause I do have a lot of errands to go run today. So I'll see you guys very soon. It is a few days later and I figured I'd just show you guys everything I got in my haul. I only got a few things. Also, I just wanna preface this by saying that um, there's four dogs running around in this house. We are currently watching my in-laws dogs and they have, they've been in Spain for the last two weeks. So we have four dogs for the last two weeks and I'm, I love dogs, but I'm ready to just go back to my two. Like four dogs is too many. When they outnumber you, it's like they're like a pack. You know what I mean? So yeah, so if you see little animals everywhere, I'm sorry. And if they're clicking around or like drinking, they're crazy, so. <laughs> They outnumber me. First thing I got from Goodwill is these super cute little earrings. They were $2.50 and they really remind me of a small version of those gold hoops that I got from my Princess Polly haul. If you guys haven't seen my Princess Polly haul, I got some really cute little chain earrings from Princess Polly. And these just reminded me of them. They kind of look like a little chain link. Oh. So they look like a little chain, but they're like much more small than my other ones. And I just really like them. I love hoops and I love gold jewelry. So I like hoops of all shapes and sizes and like different styles. Got these little guys, they were 250 and they are so stinking cute. This was the first thing that I picked up when I got into Goodwill. Hold on, let me button it up. I don't know who that is, but I also don't care is a super funky little shirt. It has this really interesting fabric. It's kind of like a rusty orange with a bunch of like little yellow and like flowers and like paisleys. Well, I guess they're not paisleys, but they kind of like have that same vibe. And then what I also really like about this shirt is the, or this blouse is the neckline. It just has like a really cool little like fold right there. And it is a little bit cropped. So I love that it wasn't a really, really long shirt. I don't know when I saw this shirt, I just felt like it was so like fall chic, fall, fall funky, I would say. Um, it is from the brand Tent Club. I feel like it looks kind of older, but I could be totally wrong. That could be a more modern shirt. I just thought it was funky and fun. It would be cute with like black jeans or trousers. And it was $4.99. So I got this guy, it is a medium. It was $2.99. It's just this really beautiful slip dress. It's black and then it has this kind of like crisscrossing in the front and in the back of like this mesh material. And I tried it on and I loved it. It's just really pretty. I feel like it does go down quite a ways. So I'm gonna have to like wear something under it, like a little bandeau or something. It's really pretty though. And I've really been getting into all of the like silky little slip dresses you guys know i got one from princess polly and i recently got that other beautiful silk one a few weeks back and i love that i get so many compliments on it what i also really liked about this one too is it has a nice slit and this one is very long like it goes all the oh ooh, in this i didn't even realize that it has a slit but in the slit it's like a mesh material so it's like silky and then it has like in the slit it's like, what's this called? See-through, I don't know what it's called. <laughs> I'll think of it later. You guys will tell me in the comments, but it has this like see-through little piece. I honestly thought this was super cute, really pretty. I could pair things under it or over it. I've looked up on Pinterest black silky slip dress and I have so many different ideas of ways to style that. And then this was really fun and funky. I picked up this Victoria Secrets, I don't know what you call this. It was $7 and it's like, it's like a robe dress. It's like a blanket dress or like a giant sweater that goes all the way down to the floor that you're just supposed to like wear around the house. It has a hood, it has a zipper that goes halfway down. It has a pocket in the center so you can put, you know, your phone and stuff. And it's really, really long all the way down to the floor. So it keeps you like nice and warm and cozy. It's almost like a robe dress. Let me know if there's like an official name for this, you guys. But yeah, I thought it was awesome. Our house is really cold in the winter time because we try not to turn the heater on unless we're like dying. <laughs> so I usually wear a ton of layers in the winter. And so yeah, I picked this up because I knew I was gonna watch a ton of TV, wear this and be cozy 
in our freezing house. And like I said, it was $7.99 from Victoria's Secret. And that was everything from my haul, you guys. I hope you guys liked it. I know that it wasn't very many things, but I've been trying to be more selective with what I get and keep it like to the things that I love instead of just like, I like that and it's cheap. I want to like focus on love items only. So I'm also going, since my in-laws are coming back from Spain tomorrow, we have to go pick them up in San Francisco and that's like three hours away from where I live. So I asked Everett if we could go a little bit early and go to some thrift stores that I never go to. When we were driving to drop them off at the airport to leave, I saw a Savers on the side of the road. I think it was in like Fairfield or Vacaville or something. So I'm gonna try to ask Everett if when we leave tomorrow to go pick them up, we can leave a few hours early and I can go to that Savers and go thrifting, so. You guys should see some new content, a new thrift store on my channel. I know that a lot of you guys have savers, but we don't. So that's exciting and hopefully it's good. I'm excited to check it out and try something new. All right, you guys, I think that is it for this haul. I love you guys so, so much and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Bye.